Hi, Jerry Capote here of walldecalbusiness.com. Thanks for stopping by. In this video, I'm going to show you the unsetup of your vinyl cutter, in this case, the Roland GX24, and what to do with those files once you're done with them. So let's get started. With the vinyl cutter, what I do is I like to get the, the cartridge out of the way before I remove the, the vinyl. So what I do is I go to Menu and click on it until I see Unsetup. Once I see that, I can press Enter and the cartridge will go back to its starting point is what it does. So it's out of the way. So now I can release the vinyl right here from this lever brings up the, the rollers, so it releases it. So now I can actually take my vinyl, roll it back, bring it out very easily, and there it is, okay? So I'll put that away. And actually the, the vinyl cutter now is ready either for a new roll, to install a new roll, or if I'm done with it for the day, then I can just uh, boot it down and put it away. So that's what I'll do. Let me boot that down. Put that away, and now let's take a look at our files. So what I do with the Cut Studio file is either I exit and don't save it if I feel I can redesign the file quickly, but most of the time I do save it just in case uh, uh, you know customer calls back and says you know can you send me one just like that one. So uh, I like to save the files. So I name it the file based on the name on the decal. If I have that name more than once, I might add a two at the end of it or a three. And I save it and it jumps to the Adobe Illustrator file where your Cut Studio file originated from. Now this particular file you do not want to save at all. That's because you want to keep your original template as it was so you can work on it. And when you're done with it, what you want to do is just close the file and it'll ask you, do you want to save changes? No. And that's it. Leave it alone. Don't want to touch your template. So that's it. That's the unsetup of the vinyl cutter. And that's what I do with my files. So I hope that helps out. Uh, for more instructional videos, go to walldecalbusiness.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.